In this video, we will look at how you can add and animate a camera in ToonSquid. In order to add a camera layer, you tap this plus button in the timeline and select camera. There can be at most one camera layer in each timeline. So now that we already have one, we can't add another one. The camera layer defines the portion of your animation that should be visible in the final export. By default, the camera shows the same area that you see when you export without a camera. But now we can scale it, move it, and rotate it with the transform tool, just like any other layer, in order to focus on different parts of our animation. For example, in order to animate the camera zooming into our animation, we can add a keyframe here and scale down the camera layer. Only the area within this rectangle will be visible in the export. We can also use keyframes to move the camera. And just like with other layers, we can use Bezier handles to create curved motion paths. That's how the camera movement is animated in this demo project, as you can see here. By default, when you hit the play button, the canvas will focus on the camera layer and follow its movement to make it easier for you to visualize what the final export will look like. However, you can also disable this in the settings. Lastly, note that hiding the camera layer only hides the visualization on the canvas, but the camera will still affect the export. If you want to remove it completely, you have to delete the camera layer.